Hi everyone, it's Linda here. I have been to Kmart, so I thought I will do a haul. Um, yeah, give this video a thumbs up, leave me a comment, uh, let me know what you thought of what I brought and if there's anything out there that you think that I would really like, let me know. I love Kmart. Um, as you can see, pillow Kmart, chair Kmart, the flower arrangement Kmart. Um, and a lot of other things came up. So, yeah, <laughs> um, I'll, I'll be making a, I, I'm guessing I'll be making a lot of these came out hauls um, and possibly even reviews on some of the items. I'm planning on buying the steam mop. I do have a really expensive steam mop, um, but I just, it's just a hassle to get out and I've seen Kmart, I don't know whether my Kmart will have it because I'm in a bit of an isolated area out of in Victoria countryside. So I don't know whether they'll have it in stock, but they've got a steam mop, which is just a stick with the, you just plug it in. Whereas the, the steam mop, the Mille steam mop that I have is a whole unit. So I might do a review on that um, very soon. I've got to convince my husband to not check the bank accounts <laughs> so <laughs> I can buy that big purchase. But anyhow, so I'll get started. I brought two of these um, 2.4 litre uh, push close containers. I've, I will be putting flour in these. Um, not too long ago, I brought the tall version of this and they're a little bit skinnier um, for my cereal. We've recently finished building a house, like when I'm saying recently, I'm still saying recently, even though we've been living in here for a year, but I'm still trying to get myself organized, being that I've got a one year old and that year was just hectic. Um, so I'm still trying to organize my pantry to look a little bit more neater, considering, you know, it's a decent sized pantry and I don't want it to be a whole heap of mess for much longer so these ones here are awesome so I'm slowly slowly um, building up um, my supply in this and I'm figuring out and they've, these are they've got them all different sizes so I can tell you that I'm gonna have more of these in my haul alrighty next I brought pajamas I brought um, for my three-year-old I wanted pajamas that had pants and a long sleeve top but this one here was a three set and I thought awesome he'll still fit into these by the end of the year he's he'll just he's the type of child that will grow tall but he's very slim build um, so this is from the organic range it's really really soft it's amazing um, and it came with a long sleeve top also which is awesome but it came with a t-shirt. This was a uh, 15, if I'm not mistaken. Yep, 15. Um, and I figured because he's, he's gonna fit into this when it warms up again in September, October, um, this will still fit him, so it's awesome. I also brought another pair of pajamas. It's got tractors on it. Um, I don't know if this is in the organic range. Where's the tag? Oh, I can't find the tag, but I'm I'm mm, I I'm thinking that this was eleven dollars. Yeah, I'm thinking that this was eleven dollars. Um, so a long sleeve pajama set. He is taller training, and I'm finding during the night when he's wearing a onesie zip up, he's coming to me even though he's wearing a nappy. He's still coming to me, waking me up because he he's just tired and he, and, and he just seems too much for him to unzip himself and, and he takes it all off. And yeah, so I figured two piece, way to go and it's cooling down. So his shorts and t-shirts aren't going for, you know, he's cold. So I thought I'll grab these. Um, I will stock up on a few more. I didn't see anything else that I liked there. Um, but I'm sure like with the colder weather coming, they're going to be coming out with different, different, um, 
you know, designs on them. So that was a, a good purchase. I also brought myself one of these tops. It's $12. Um, and the sleeves are like this. And it just, it sits nice. Like, it's the same top as this, but it's like, it's got this, I don't know, crisscross triangle. Sh um, yeah. Anyway, so I thought, I, I love the sleeves. I, I do have a little bit of an arm there. So I love um, where the sleeves land. So I thought I'll grab this. Um, and they're handy, especially now in Victoria, we're having a little bit of a weird weather. Um, and some days it might be really warm and the next minute it's cold, but you don't want to like, you know, completely put a massive jumper on. This, this works awesome over a, a singlet top. So yeah grab that. I also grabbed these leggings. It's uh, a jegging for my daughter. This was $10 <clears throat> and it seems like, yeah, no, no, it's not the organic range, but yeah, so it's got this little design there. Um, I thought it was cute. I also picked up this cute little long sleeve top. It's really, really cute. I also picked up this short sleeve top with the peplum on the bottom also I just I just love it I love it um, this was down to five dollars from seven dollars I guess because you know they're coming out with the the winter stock um, but this is still cute to wear if we were to you know go out um, and I would want her to be a little bit more dressed up um, this gold is a glittery sort of um stitching it's not it's not glued on it's it's in the stitching which is awesome and she can you know in a, on a cooler day she can wear this with a cardigan and some leggings and yeah it'll be really cute i also brought her a two-piece pajamas really really cute it's in it's almost like a blush color i don't know how it's coming up on the screen but it's really cute it's got this design this little um, lace on the bottom and on the arms really really cute this was ten dollars from the cotton range which was really yeah. I find that their range even though they're a little bit more expensive they're cute I picked up this jumper it's more of a quilted material for my son um, really really cute um, and it's thick a lot thicker than some of the jumpers that I'm seeing at Kmart. Um, and this was $15. So yeah, I'm just stocking up for the winter months now. The last thing I picked up was this jacket for my little girl. Um, really, really cute. It's thick. Um, it's got little pockets and it's got like some palm trees and flowers on it just really cute um, and this was $15 so the total amount I spent at Kmart is $116 oh, are we gonna, are we gonna switch? $116 and 16 cents um, yeah so hopefully you like this haul let me know what you thought give me a thumbs up subscribe um leave me a nice comment and i'll get back to you um if there's anything that you've seen that you know at kmart that you think that i should um review let me know i'm happy to do reviews uh i mean i guess we can you know it's easy it's you know a lot there's a lot of review videos out there so I'm sure you'll be able to find something out there but I'm more than happy to do reviews for you um, I absolutely love Kmart um, I, sometimes I'm you know I'll walk into Kmart and I'm wearing head-to-toe Kmart items and I kind of feel a bit weird but you know what seasons come in and out styles change and I, I I can't justify spending a hell of a lot of money 
on staples in the cupboard um and it be you know and by you know next winter this you know the style is going to change and the color scheme is going to change so i i can't justify spending a heap of money um kmart's amazing so hopefully you like this haul give me a thumbs up again <laughs> and spread the words um and hopefully we will be able to communicate with each other and build a community within this channel um and yeah i will see you next time check out my coles haul i did receive a coles delivery when i got back from kmart i find it easy getting coles delivery um and you know i love going into kmart even though kmart and coles are next door to each other um we're in the shopping center where i am but yeah, so I got a cold delivery. I just did a quick call on that so I could put everything in the fridge. Um, so check that out. Let me know what you thought. And hopefully these videos will become more structured and maybe I will become a bit more confident. Let me know what you thought. And any, any, just keep it positive. Um, I won't take anything to heart. Um, so let me know what you thought and I will work on it. Um, this is just an adventure I, you know, I, you know, want to do being a stay at home mum. Um, and if it works out, perfect. Um, if not, it just gives me a little bit of an outlet to, you know, you know, talk and communicate and considering I'm going shopping all the time, <laughs> um, I thought, why not? Let's give it a go and see how it goes. So anyhow, I'll leave it there. Enough of me gibbering and jabbering and talking too much. <laughs> um, my little one's just woken up, so I'm going to have to go get her. Uh, so I will chat to you very soon. And yeah, let me know what you thought. I'll see you in the next haul. Bye.